Okay guys, so what we're going to do now is I'm going to show you a very quick and easy way of rounding numbers by using the formatting cell feature, the formatting cell feature. Okay, it's actually a lot easier than you think. This is before we do actual rounding functions. So this is before we learn those functions. So here we go. And you can see here in cell A2, I've got 6.748. And I want you to round that to one decimal using the cell formatting feature. Now, over here in my number group, this is where you need to be. And you will see that you have an increase decimal and a decrease decimal. Okay, so it's actually super easy. So watch this. I'm going to take this over here. I'm going to just control C, control V. I'm going to just copy and paste, copy and paste. All right. Oh, my yellow went away. Oh, well. And I'm going to change this to one decimal. So I'm not going to edit this. I'm not going to type in and remove the numbers. I don't want to do that. I don't want this value to change. Okay. So I'm just going to decrease the decimal. One, two, there we go. That is now one decimal place. That was actually pretty easy. So I'm going to do the rest of here for you. I'm just going to copy all of them. Control C, Control V. Okay, there we go. And you know what? I want them yellow. So let's just keep them yellow. There we go. Cool. Now we can see what we're doing. So here we go. This must be two decimals. Two decimals. So just go down, go down, go down. Two. Oh, that was easy. No decimals. Oh, click, 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 click. This is all just a, this is a clicking exercise. There we go. Three decimals. Uh, oh, oh dear. Sorry. There we go. And four decimals. But don't go and decrease because it's only got one decimal. So we need to increase the decimal. So there's four decimal places. And that, my dear friends, in a nutshell, is your increasing and decreasing of decimals, rounding. Now, actually, before we end, let me just show you. So for example, have a look, have a look. This is 6.748. If you round that, it becomes 6.7. All right, if this was 6.75, that should be 6.8. In fact, let's test that. I'm going to test that. Seven, five, eight. Okay, are you watching? All right, so 6.758. Just copy that, paste there. 6.758. I'm going to round that, and it was 6.7. It should go now to 7.8. 6.8, 7.8, 6.8, 6.8. Increase, decrease, decrease, decrease. 6.8. There it is. Go back. 6.7. 6.8. The value hasn't changed. It's just showing us the rounded up or rounded down number depending on the decimals. Okay, so keep that in mind when you are using this feature. Okay, but there you go. Enjoy.